Hello, everyone. Let's get started, shall we? Today's 4-22-22. Wonderful day. Uh, it's also Earth Day, which is uh, very auspicious, uh, as I've been told, and, and a you know, phenomenal day as well for, for a lot of reasons. We have a lot of updates, uh, a lot of uh, everything that everyone is ready for. Um, so let's let's dive kind of straight into some of those. Um, one element I think this week has been incredible. The the quiz has been absolutely to use that word um, awesome as a as as such a great not only a, a way for the community to see and and kind of find their understanding of Fisk and Fiscus. Uh, but also from a perspective of of knowing and for those that are new to be able to know uh, truly what we are about. Um, we as a core team really stand behind this. And so because of that, very happy to announce that we are increasing uh, the amount of reward uh, for the for the quiz. Instead of it being 10 uh, P Fisk, uh, it's actually 50. And that would be for the for the five winners um, that uh, that have those perfect scores that are that are chosen there. Uh, again, you know, it's amazing the knowledge that is being shared by community members. Uh, there's so much gratefulness from 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 myself, from the core team. You know, when it comes to every every minute that has been spent on the on the business of Fiscus. This is something that is, as everyone knows, this is a project that's like all others, you know, founded in, in a way that no other project has been founded uh, by individuals that have come together, including everyone here. Uh, everyone here is a part of that. Everyone here is a part of our, our, our genesis story, our initiation, right? The beginning. Uh, and, and we're truly at that point. And, and so again, as always, thank you. Thank everyone here, uh, everyone that's consistently uh, in the audience, in the in the chats, uh, in the community. That's that's truly Fisk is strong. Uh, regarding NFTs, some updates there. Uh, obviously, several hundred have been minted already, uh, which is incredible. Uh, we've we've already seen the the secondary market already beginning to uh, beginning to expand. Uh, we have, uh, of course, our, our collections have been certified on Kaleo as well. So there's that protection. We just, again, admonish everyone to please utilize the official contract addresses when it comes to the NFTs. Uh, we know that there's, there's obviously, there's, there's unscrupulous out there. And as we begin this next phase, we know that that will increase. You know, in the, in the Discord, we've had many that have acted as if they are some of our admins. Uh, and you know, of course, those those have been quickly uh, found and and banned. Uh, and again, we'll continue to do that. You know, as we gain in in stature as as Fiscus, we know that that's going to be an element uh, that's that will continue to happen. This is crypto, and so we always want to have protections in place. And so again, when we talk about all things uh, Fisk related, all things uh, NFTs. Please mind those official contract addresses. We don't want anyone to get taken advantage of. We don't want anyone to uh, to to lose at all. Uh, it's it's been exciting seeing the secondary market again start there with Kaleo. I know I have a I have a, a, a call, um, and Kyle has a call with the uh, with the founder of Kaleo, and so that's something that that we look forward to. The expansion there. Uh, there's several other organizations that will be um, not only posting and tweeting about Fiscus and about our partnerships with them. Uh, very excited for that. I think on the biggest one, I, I can't say the name yet. And we'll just wait for that to come out so everyone will see it uh, and have that excitement there. Um, looking over some notes here. Uh, also, when we when we look at what we've done so far, and this is this is highlighted in the in the evolution of, of Fiscus, and that's just been posted. So now everybody will will need maybe a little time in the in the digesting of that and in the understanding of that. Uh, but one thing I think everybody's come to realize when it comes to Fiscus is that 
again, you know, we're, we do things from a perspective of, of taking the time to think, right? Measuring twice, cutting once. Uh, for us, it feels like at times maybe measuring four or five times and, and, and cutting once and being all the way up to the point and making sure that safety is, the, is, is of the utmost concern and security is of the utmost concern. And again, we do that from the perspective, not just because of, of you know, everyone being involved now from a physical perspective and continually, but it's, it's, it's great habit, right? It's, it's core competencies. It's something that has to be done because again, we are not just a, a, a meme token that uh, that is will be here today and gone tomorrow. We're not just a a fork of a project that uh, that really has no has no long term utility and viability. We're the opposite of that, uh, you know. And, and we've always we've always stayed the course there. Uh, there's an there's an interesting point that I wanted to to talk about today uh, as we as we do what we're about to do, and I'm reminded. There was a an astronaut by the name of Stephen Hawley that was ready, strapped in, ready to go in the rocket numerous times. Uh, some some say four, some say five times, but and and the uh, the the launches were scrapped, um, you know, for for one checklist item or another uh, that came up. And so when we think about that, you know, we understand what that has, what that has felt like, truly, uh, to be there, to be that ready for this rocket to take off. And so again, gratitude, uh, appreciate the patience from the community. Again, those that have have expressed, you know, disappointment, fine. That is so fine, and 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 we share that, and and we're with you. You know, those that have, have gone over that line and received a ban, that's exactly what, what we're here to do and we'll always continue to do that even, even post-launch. Um, very humbled by what has happened with, with Fiscus. Um, from, from starting out and knowing the potential and really seeing it evolve and seeing the evolution of it. And so much of this is expressed in that announcement. And so I won't, I won't uh, dive into too much of that at all. Um, but when, when we look at that and we look at the changes, you know, that are occurring, I'm reminded and, and say this humbly of, and I use this example, you know, so much, but I'm reminded of, you know, a, a Larry Page or a Sergey Brin, you know, being able to allow the transition of an Eric Schmidt. I'm reminded of a, of a Mark Zuckerberg bringing in a Sheryl Sandberg. And, you know, from us, from, from the leadership team and in that announcement, this is exactly where we are in our, in our, in, in our growth and, and where we are along this path. Operational excellency is, is vital. An impregnable reputation and, and character is vital. Uh, we are in the position now where we have, and, and I, I, I'm going to say this, even if they don't want me to say this, we're going to say this, but I'm not saying they don't. But we're in the position where we have billions of dollars in assets that can, will be flowing in uh, to the Treasury. And I'm, we're just talking about OFTP. And so in order for that to really be smooth and seamless, we need to have a, a clear and concise leadership team. We need to have the, the reputation that is un, unassailable, right? And so with that being said, I am more than happy to being able to transition to being inside of, of Fiscus Central. Um, it was said many, many months ago, that if the, if the time ever came for that to happen, that I would do so happily and, and willingly and would be skipping as, as, as it occurs. 
And, and now is that time. You know, it was always in the cards. It was always planned, if you will. Um, and and now, is, now is fully that time. And uh, I'm honored by that. And I'm honored for those leadership changes that are occurring. Um, now, for the leadership changes to occur, there needs to be a launch, right? There needs to be a full-fledged launch. Uh, and I am happy and have the honor of being able to say, and, I, and I'm, I'm watching my words so carefully here, uh, and, and again, some of this will be um, because, again, we are not going to announce, I'm looking at my notes here, uh, specifically from, from Tram, I'm calling you out right now. Um, I'm not going to announce that we will be uh, launching at this very second, but I will say, please, please stay in the Discord right now and, and stay on Twitter uh, because of the imminence, uh, the imminency. I'm not sure if that's the right word or not, but let's, let's go with that. Um, it, is, it is near and nigh. And so again, very humbled, very honored, very thankful for the community. And, and with that, I would like to turn it over to our, our new CEO of Fiscus Ecosystem, Kyle Sarwal. Thank you, Phil. Um, well, it's, a, it's an honor and a privilege to represent Fiscus and you know, serve our community you know, in a different capacity than we have been, and I really appreciate that. Um, I'm super excited to be working uh, with such an amazing admin team, core team, uh, committee members. You know, it's just we've got uh, the right skill set around us, and I feel like that's going to be uh, super con conducive to our success. Um, and I'd like to thank uh, our devs, uh, particularly. Um, we know that they've been working their asses off, uh, our committee members, and, and again, the entire admin, mod, and core team. Um, you know, just they've they've all been very supportive. We've, uh, I mean, people in the forums, they are in the channels, they know that we've uh, had to deal with uh, a lot of questions, a lot of interesting comments, and um, it really hasn't been an, an easy couple months. But you know, we're here and uh, and we're quite excited. Um, I want to say congrats to the new Fiscus leadership team, and I'm looking forward to working closely with everybody. Uh, I know we've got, again, stellar skill set here at this level, and, uh, and there's going to be some amazing things that we do together, both on-chain and off-chain. Um, also look forward to the launch and, I guess, our post-launch procedures. We have, you know, gotten to the point of, of launch here, which is upcoming. Um, but again, getting through launch and then what happens after that is, is really um, where my focus is at. You know, where we look at what happens sort of off chain, how we continue continue to build value, and we take this you know token from an opening seventeen dollar value to you know to the fucking moon, right? Like let's let's get there. So this is really you know again a point where uh, our collective real work starts. Um, you know I'll keep this short and sweet, um, with more to come throughout next week and uh, and during next week's uh, AMA. Um, just seeing if there's any comments here that uh, that any one want me to respond to quickly um launch right timing for launch so we're going to um make an announcement again keep your eyes peeled on on socials on twitter on on discord um given the theme here of of it being 4 22 22 launch will occur sometime in the next four hours and 22 minutes uh, i'm not going to give a time right now you know i'm going to put it on you to, to pay attention and, and sorry if that interrupts your day any but um, we'll make an announcement and, um, and there we have it. We've hit launch. So stay tuned. Uh, and again, thank you all and see you on the other side of our launch. Um, oh, by the way, if you haven't already, uh, you know, please read up on bonding and staking, understand what all that's about. I feel like there's not enough, uh, understanding or research done on some of these mechanisms that can really drive additional wealth to, to our investors. And I wouldn't be doing my job correctly unless, uh, you know, if I didn't sort of emphasize that. Um, so again, see you guys on the other side of launch. Stay tuned and, uh, and talk soon. Bye.